John, please. Well, thank you, Mr. President. Uh, th this is what our ranchers and our farmers, our producers across this great country are after. These are the kind of agreements that really make a difference. And, and that's what this is about. This is about access to markets. We produce the highest quality beef anywhere in the world. They have great hats, but they have great cattle. They do a great job. Uh, our ranchers across this uh, country are absolutely the best in the world. So when we get access to markets, then they can really go to town uh, and outcompete uh, really anybody anywhere. So whether it's the ranchers or farmers, whether it's livestock, whether it's crops, this is the kind of agreement we need. Uh, again, I want to express appreciation to the president and to his whole team, to, to uh, Ag Secretary Sonny Purdue, certainly to USTR Lighthizer, to uh, Ambassador Dowd, to the whole team. They're working very hard on behalf of agriculture. You know about the assistance they're providing, but that assistance is because our farmers and our ranchers have been targeted by China and other countries. So the administration and USDA is standing up for our farmers while they're negotiating these kinds of agreements. And I'm anxious to see what they can do with Japan. And uh, we've got to get the USMCA uh, through the Congress. We need the House to bring it up. The Senate is ready to go. We're ready to pass it with a big bipartisan vote. But each of these steps are critically important for our farmers. And again, uh, on behalf of all of us in the Senate that work in agriculture, this is what we want. These kind of agreements tripling what we can put into uh, the beef that we can export to Europe uh, under this uh, agreement between the United States and Europe. So again, congratulations. And on behalf of agriculture, thank you. Great, Jim. Thank you very much. Thank you, Mr.